What did you get for number six in assignment four for math? I can't figure out what the answer is. Yeah, I can't seem to get that one either. Didn't we get an email about free tutoring? Yeah, I think it was called the Math and Stat Learning Center. We should try it out. Hi, I'm looking for help for my math class. Okay, well you've come to the right place. We have lots of things to offer. What class are you taking? I'm in Math 1151. Okay, well then let's look on our website and look at the tutoring services for that. For 1151, it says that we have tutoring hours from Monday through Thursday, 1020 to 4 p.m. And on Fridays from 1020 to 150 p.m. in Calkins Hall 004. We also have evening tutoring for that class in the 18th Avenue Library. And we also have some online tutoring. So we have a map of our tutor rooms, and I can show you where that's it, so where that is. So let's take a walk, okay? Hi, I'm here for tutoring. You can go ahead and sign into the computer using your name dot number, and then just have a seat. All the tutors are wearing name tags, and they'll help you out anytime you have a question. Before going to the MSLC, you should have already attempted to solve the problems. You should also have questions in mind to ask the tutor. You are welcome to arrive early and work on problems while you wait for a tutor. The tutors will help all students in the room and answer questions as needed. Keep in mind that the MSLC is not a substitute for your lecture or recitation. So our tutors will not work your problems for you and they cannot offer one-on-one -on -one tutoring for your entire visit. They cannot guarantee help for everyone who comes in on exam day or the day an assignment is due. Come in before that time for maximum attention. Thanks for helping me out. I still feel like I'll need some more help though because I have an exam coming up. Okay, so there are a few resources that might help you out. One are actually online lessons. Um, for every section of the book that you go through, there's an associated online lesson uh, that includes lots of example problems and even practice quizzes. Um, and then any other resources that are available, um, you can find listed on the MSLC course website or actually on this bulletin board over here as well, if you wanna come look. I noticed you were struggling a lot with the topic of related rates, so I wanted to point out that we have this um, workshop coming up, and there are several different times um, that hopefully will fit in your schedule. Um, in these workshops, basically they do a lot of examples and even some group work, um, so they're a really great resource to help you with some of the more uh, difficult topics in calculus. It says here that there are exam reviews on the website. Yeah, okay, so the exam reviews are another great resource. Um, for each exam, uh, they'll be posted online. Um, there's a lot of practice problems, basically, um, things that you should know for the exam. And then when you're done, there's a PDF of solutions that you can look over to make sure that you did things correctly. Um, in addition, if you get stuck on that or if you have questions from the workshop, your TA um, and also your lecturer are a really great resource. You can always go to their office hours to ask questions. I've never been to my instructor TA before. It's really not as scary as it seems to go talk to them. Um, they know a lot about the course. They can help you know what to expect on the tests. Um, and also if you have a question about your grade, they're really the best person to ask about that. What if I can't make it to office hours? Well, if you can't make it to office hours or tutoring here, you have a couple of options. Um, one is online tutoring. We offer online tutoring for a few of our more common courses. Um, you can find the hours just by going to the MSLC website. Um, another option is getting a private tutor, um, if that's something you feel like you can afford. Um, there's a list of private tutors for hire on the MSLC website that are all approved. Um, and one more thing, if your course uses My Math Lab, you'll notice when you're working through the problems that there's a button that says Ask My Instructor. So if you click that button, it'll actually send your question to a tutor. Um, when you're using that though, just make sure you ask plenty of time in advance because those tutors aren't online constantly. So those are all great resources that should help you if you can't come to tutoring or office hours. Thank you, I didn't realize there were so many ways to get help. Glad to help, and we'll see you soon at the Math and Stats Learning Center.